Hi, this is Peter Cunningham talking about entrepreneur, finance, business and money. I want to talk about money and how does money affect you, Mollery, and your beliefs about money? Do you believe that um, money should be shared out to everyone equally? Do you believe that the rich should give to the poor a Robin Hood cycle? Do you believe that the rich are evil and people who do bad things and step on people's toes to get rich or do you believe money is the root of all evil and being poor is righteousness and being poor is the way to get into the kingdom of heaven because the weak shall inherit the earth do you believe that money is evil and people who's got money does not deserve uh, to go into heaven if there is such a, a place all them beliefs and thoughts and questions now i believe and this is my opinion again i believe money is spiritual I believe money is spiritual because it brings people together. You get money from another person and we trade. We trade values and we trade skills and we trade talents. And we have a trade-off with one another. I will pay you to do my marketing for my business because you've got the skill of a marketeer and I haven't. So I will give you this money if you provide me that service. That is a trade between two people a equal trade 50 50 a win-win situation for both of us we are both going to benefit from the transaction and we are both serving each other this is where the spiritual content comes in is serving that person who knows the skills and study marketing is serving me and I'm providing them with money now it goes further down the line why do I want a marketeer or someone who does my marketing for my business that's so They've got that skill so I can serve myself as well more people. So I want their skill to market my business, to shout out my service and my product to people so I can serve them. And it goes on and goes on and circulates we are serving each other one another person around the globe and doing transactions giving money and service and products and serving each other and bringing people together in a good way this is why money is spiritual Money circulates around the world.
and it serves people and brings people together in a win-win friendly good way of helping each other helping your fellow man and woman and trading off not ripping off each other that's another thing we're not talking about that we're talking about good products and service helping each other this is what is spiritual we are helping God's children and serving God's children and helping each other globally now isn't that what God wants us to do is to help each other in a good friendly way and communicating with each other and getting to know each other and making each other happy with our service and products and our transaction money spiritual it brings people together and this is what god wants us to do this is why business is spiritual as well and god will reward us by serving his children it goes with the territory the more people you serve globally the more people you help and help god to bring happiness and light into the world through your business and transaction then you will be rewarded for it and why shouldn't we and the reward could be money and possibly is money but there's also other rewards as well benefits we get by serving and helping each other so this is why God has designed money, trading, transaction, meeting one another. And not only that, look at the 21st century. Now we can communicate a lot easier. So God is even giving us the technology and the knowledge to make technology and make it easier for us to communicate around the world and serve each other around the globe a lot easier. God has given us that technology and give us the knowledge to do that. So money is spiritual. Money and business brings people together. I hope you enjoyed that small video, my point of view about money being spiritual. And remember, take care of each other. Bye-bye.